Well, good news. There is no sign of a crash. Um, in fact, business seems to be picking up on the for sale properties and more and more properties are coming in on instruction. What I'm seeing on average is there's about a 6% price correction. That is a correction, that is not a crash. However, there is a, a slightly more worrying uh, trend in that I am seeing properties with some agents coming onto the market, certainly basing the marketing price on what was possible to get last year. My fear, is not only will those vendors find their houses sticking on the market, but also having enough houses sticking on the market because it's been priced at a, an unrealistic price has other, um, has other problem, problems with it as well in that it starts to clog up the market. Make sure that the comparisons, the price comparisons and the property comparisons that you're shown maybe last summer but they're not going to be replicated marketed price there have been 32 percent less sales transactions than there were this time last year of that 32 percent reduction the actual number in wrexham over the last three months 1572 houses or residential properties sold the average price now of a property in wrexham is 191,000 pounds and the average in Wales is £197,000. And for those of you who want reassurance that property is still a worthwhile investment, over the last five years, property prices on average in Wrexham, in the county of Wrexham, have gone up by 27%. Now, if your money in your bank account had gone up by 27% over the last five years, then I'm sure you would be delighted but as we all know the interest rate increases there on um, any savings has been modest demand for rental property from prospective tenants it's outstripping uh, supply and now by some considerable margin you're looking now at an average rent across all agents in wrexham of 689 uh, pounds per month an increase of 8% on the last 12 months alone. If you just look at our own office, our average now is running between 725 and 730 pounds per calendar month. Numbers that landlords would, wouldn't have even thought possible two or three years ago. So with so much going on in the property market, we thought it would be a great idea to ask Caris Bailey to come along and give us some advice, best advice, on mortgages in particular in this current market.